just see Bumblebee flying past him on a truck? Yes, Bumblebee's here. Bumblebee is officially happy and alive. Very good. Very good. <laughs> oh, you, you win. One, two, three. Okay, okay, slow, 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 slow. Oh, okay, okay. Okay, 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 okay. Okay, 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 okay. Bravo! Perfect. Nice. 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 Okay. Bravo! Yay! <laughs> oh, cool. <laughs> Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> yes! Bravo! Oh, Thank, wow. you. Thank you so much. Thank you. That's awesome. I think I think I'm going to Oh, the battery's dead. No way. Yeah. That's so funny, I literally just started it before. Wait a minute. Let me just turn it off again. Yeah. The battery was disconnected, so it should be fine. Yeah. Oh, no. Um, <clears throat> okay. Maybe we have to jump start it. Yeah. Okay. Oh. Uh, battery dead. Yeah. yeah, I think battery dead. Yeah. Okay, push, 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 push. Wait a second. Wait. Okay, now it needs to be faster. Wait, faster, 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 faster. Okay. No. Yeah. Okay, okay. Plus and minus. Okay. Okay. Okay, yeah. Oh, no, no, minus. Yeah, minus. Yeah, voltage, voltage. Voltage, yep. Uh, 13, yes. Uh huh, yeah, okay. Yes! Yes! No, no, it's okay. Why the Why the Why the Oh my god, there we go! We are finally, finally, finally on the street, moving with Bumblebee. That's amazing. Wow, that looks nice here, hey? Cool, yeah, wow, look at all the lights! I can't believe wow. it! This entire building is just covered in LEDs. We have a really cool room here. Check that out. First of all, never seen, but here is a computer, like a proper computer. We turn it on, it's working. <laughs> the work can start. <laughs> then we have a kettle, we have a hairdryer, we have a fridge, a phone. And then here's a crazy section as well with a, a brush and like hairspray and stuff like this. I mean, seriously? <laughs> The uh, rooms here in Korea seem really, really well equipped. And it's got some mood lighting as well, which is actually really nice. Look, look, look. This one. No. Ah. No, the window's open. Okay. And a really big bathtub as well. What the bike? This one? This one. This one. This one. This one. This one. This one. Yeah. Oh, Okay. <laughs> Thank you again. 
go. That's it. At least the numbers are the same, hey? <laughs> Awesome. Well, that was super fast. Everybody else has already left. <laughs> the boat, we're the last ones. This guy's on a giant bike wearing flip-flops. Your shoes! <laughs> <laughs> what a crazy bike, look at that. Wow. It is homemade tofu noodle mix. <clears throat> oh. oh man, that's really spicy. If you eat the noodles, I think it's fine. And also make sure that the sauce is not touching your lips, otherwise your lips will burn like crazy. Mm. Woo! Oh. Oh. Why do they make it like that? Who, who wants that? Also, it says on the pack, that it was Mexican flavor, but it's just chili. There's nothing else. <laughs> My <sighs> mouth is burning. Hello. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, here. Yeah. Okay. Look at all of these guys with their traditional outfits. Wow. By the order of the commander, the gate guards will form into lines. <laughs> so pretty. Wow. Hello. <laughs> you guys look absolutely amazing. Yeah, it's beautiful. Oh. Very nice to meet you! We headed up into the mountains of the Siorak-san National Park. This 63 square mile reserve was designated as a UNESCO Biosphere Reserve in 1982 and it was the first Korean national park to be named under the national park law in 1970. As well as many stunning mountain peaks, the park is valued for its floral diversity and is home to many rare plants and animals. There are over 1,000 species of known plants in the reserve and 1,562 animal species have also been classified there so far. But there were also plenty of beautiful twisties for us to enjoy along the way. Halfway through, we reached the reserve's highest pass, Hang Yeo Yong, 920 meters above sea level. And the views from the top were truly incredible.
Is that tofu? So the waiter was telling us that this is actually where they make the tofu. And you can see it, there's some like giant blocks over there in the water. Looks like a dreamland for us here. Wow, <laughs> look at the size of this piece of tofu. Oh my God. Amazing. And we're having like all these little dishes here as well. <sighs> I'm in heaven. It looks so good. It so looks so good. Oh my God. Totally stuffed. <laughs> That's a lot of tofu. Just having a little lie down, hey? <laughs> I guess that's the good thing about eating on the floor. But it's a very exciting day because we are heading to the ferry terminal to take the ferry over to Russia. Yay! <laughs> I have been waiting for this day for such a long time. Yeah, I can't believe I just said like we're about to take the ferry to Russia. How crazy does that yes, sound? Yes, it's crazy. Can you pinch me? I don't know if this is true or not. Thanks, guys. Thank you. Okay, I'm going to park up in front. Oh, look, I think we're moving. Oh. We are officially on the move. We're just leaving the port of Donghae. Next stop, Vladivostok. First views of Siberia. Ooh. <laughs> Crazy place, I can't believe we're here. It's gonna be crazy. Just met up with Yuri and look what he has for us. <laughs> ah, the paper of dreams. The temporary import permit <laughs> is done. All we have to do now is go and pick up Bumblebee. Yoo! Our first views of Bumblebee. Ooh. Oh, beautiful. Yeah. There she is. Oh yes, here we go! Yoo! On the streets of Vladivostok! Oh, that's so good! Wow, what an amazing feeling! Oh wow, look at this police car! I'm trying not to point the camera at them really, obviously. I really yeah. want to be super careful about it, but that's, that's a pretty cool looking police truck, eh? Yeah! <laughs> so Sergei is going to write on our box, the box of dreams. Bravo! Russia is actually the first country where we can enjoy a nice dark bread. Look at the thickness. Oh yeah. That's some good bread. So we just stopped here at the beginning of the dirt road. What are these towns? Village. A village is? Yes. Atradnaya Ivanovka Retichovka. Okay. We meet in Tiger. Yes! Touristic государственный заповедник. Nature park. Nature park. And they say in this nature park yeah. is is Tiger. Yeah. 
It's awesome. There we go. We saw a tiger. Amazing. <laughs> cool. <laughs> mm. ah, yeah, good. because it's very fresh. Mm. Please yeah. enjoy. How, enjoy. Thank you. How do you call the fruit? I don't know. Very, you don't know. Uh, I don't know how is it in English. Oh. In Russian, it is Zimalist. 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 But in, in, in English, uh, I, I, I can't imagine. I never saw. <laughs> I never saw a berry like that. Yeah. No. But okay. it is good. It is good. Please, <laughs> please enjoy. Thank, Thank you so you. much. Have a nice trip. Thank you so much. Bye bye. bye. Here we go. Look at this. Wow, what the, there's some tiny little beds. The springs Oh no. <laughs> wow, this is like, really like, almost like child's beds. Yeah. These are really, really small. So we thought whilst we were riding so close to the Chinese border, we would make an effort to try and actually go and see China. Yeah, see Ch China. Da, da, da. da? Cool. You can wave to the people? No. No, Ruski. We have come to look at the border to China. Uh, yeah. Uh huh. <laughs> Can we escort you to uh, Venikova? Yes, okay. Da, da. All right, we're going to follow these guys into Venikova. Cool, look at this. Crossing the Trans Siberian Railway. Very cool. Yeah, look at that. It's not every day you get to say that you're crossing the Trans Siberian Railway. That's awesome. What is this? Oh. So it's like a military point. Oh, okay. Okay. Hey, that's pretty crazy, hey? Maybe we can't go through. Oh, uh, okay. Maybe it's better if we don't. Oh, uh, yeah, okay. I'm gonna uh. stop filming. Can't go any further. No. Hello. Hi. Hi. <laughs> we wanted to see the border to China. Okay, maybe China. China is here, no? Yeah, it's here. Yeah, China. <laughs> okay. A document, please. Huh? Do document. Document? You want the, okay. Tourism? Uh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. It's, the, it's okay to, to see the, the river, the border? Тут нужен пропуск. Понимаешь? Пропуск нужен. The passport. Yeah. Пропуск, чтобы проехать через ППК. Oh, no. I'm sorry. What is translation? Нужен вам пропуск. Въезд в пограничную зону. You need a pass to enter the... Ah, okay, okay. Yeah, and that was not pushed. Okay, okay. 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 That's fine, we go this way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Okay. Спасибо. 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 Okay, yep. Can you see one? Oh. Okay. Yeah, that's good. Good. Спасибо. Bye-bye. Oh, oh. Yeah, okay. <laughs> it's okay. Okay. <laughs> okay, want to see it? Okay. Okay. Bye-bye. Oh. <laughs> awesome. We made it to Svobodny. <laughs> <laughs> Woo! <laughs> <laughs> awesome! There we go. We made it. Oh. Hello! Привет! Как дела? Хорошо. Хорошо. Hello! This is Sergey's bike. Look at this KTM. Wow. This one, uh, Kartoffeln. Yeah, yeah Kartoffeln? Potato. A potato, yeah. In, in, in Russian, it's Kartoffeln? Kartoshka. Kartoshka. Cucumber, oh, agurets. A cucumber? Agurets. Agurets. Kapusta. <laughs> <laughs> Kapusta. Kapusta. Yeah. Ah, Kapusta. Ah, cool, look at this. I think we have to exchange bumblebee. <laughs> so Sergey said that he goes with his dog down to the river on this beautiful old Ural motorcycle and sidecar. Do you want a seat? Is that my is this my place? Wife <laughs> or wife. Okay, dog or wife. <laughs> <laughs> well look at this amazing breakfast spread. Salami bread butter the most delicious coffee in the world because 
the milk is hand how do you say it? Somebody was sitting there and like milking the cow. <laughs> you can really taste it. Oh, thank you. Mm. So this is Grechka. 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 Oh, with butter. I think Grechka is bulgur wheat with some butter. And what is butter again? And butter was masla. Masla. Maslo. Maslo. Well, with sort of an o. Maslo. Maslo. Cheers, spasiba. Thank you. Spasiba, thank you. Not. Not good. Uh, not good. Oh, this one. Broke. And then after. This one good, not good. I don't know. Okay. Okay, what's happening? Uh huh. This one new. Oh, it looks good. Perfect. So here. Ah, oh, it's good. You saved our lives. Pasiba, <laughs> thank you. Thank you. It's <laughs> Sergey has done it. He has found two screws that will go on our spokes and he's fixed it up. So Bumblebee is back to 100%. And also one of Sergey's friends, Lubla, is an English teacher here in Svobodny and she has brought some of her students to talk to us to uh, experience speaking with an English speaking person. So we're going to go upstairs and go and chat to them. And see what they have learned so far. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to Russia! <laughs> Thank you. One hour later. Bye. Bye bye. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Thank you. Good roll. Yes. Thank you. Yeah. No room. No. He said no, no, me and me. Okay. Thank you. We go into yeah. town then, yeah? Yeah. Okay. 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 So we're here. So those guys are full too. Yeah. Alright, we'll have to We'll have to look on the map and see what else we can find. Okay, so there's two hotels that we've been to that both say they're full. We're going to try the Municipal Hotel, it's called, and this is on the main street. So it looks like it has a lot of rooms, so I'd be really surprised if that was full as well. No rooms in this hotel. A guy just told me because of workers, a lot of workers coming here to this town, so there are no free rooms. We will try another hotel now. 20 minutes later. So it looks like even hotel number four has no rooms for us. So Lavi is asking whether or not we can camp somewhere around, like in the garden or in the courtyard or something like that. Because it looks like every single hotel in this town is completely booked up, which is kind of crazy. I'm sorry for you. <laughs> I will ask her for security reasons if we can camp underneath this bit there. Okay, so this hotel actually said that we could pitch our tent just here in front of the hotel. Yeah, she wasn't actually too happy and it took quite a while. Like I was talking to her and I was saying like because of security reasons, I said we are both very small and not very strong. So if something happens, it's not very good for us. And she's like, okay, you can camp here underneath the balcony and then you leave tomorrow morning at seven. I said, yes. Okay, deal. I prefer to pitch the tent right in front of the hotel. At least then we're a little bit, I don't know, safer maybe. We'll see. Anyway, we're gonna pitch the tent just here.
So we'll be heading to Mogosha today, Chita tomorrow, and if all goes well, we'll be reaching Ulanude the next day. Yeah, and this will be like a milestone for us because Ulan Ude is also our anti-pole point. Yes, of course, because way back, I don't even remember how far, we reached Puerto Natales at the very bottom of Chile. Puerto Natales. So that means we've officially reached Antipode 1 on our trip around the world. Congratulations! And it's crazy because Ulan Ude is on the exact opposite side of the world. <laughs> yes. And these were the first two antipodal points we made when we actually just drew the route on the map. We were like, oh yeah, we'll just go through Chile and then we'll just go through Ulan Ode next to Lake Baikal. And we're actually closing in on that part of the record. Our second antipodal point is coming up in a few days. How cool is that? I just gave these kids our sticker, he's put it on his bicycle and then Lavi and Ollie here on this bicycle Nice! Спасибо! Yes? Ah! А сколько мотоцикл стоит и сколько в нем кубов? Yeah! How are you? Good, good! Сколько месяц? 250 kilograms 250 Yes! <laughs> Whee! Bye bye! <laughs> Apparently it's here. Okay. So we just got the keys from the host and she just uh, showed us where the apartment was and we have a, quite a few flights of stairs to do. <sighs> Jesus. Whew. <coughs> Whew. Here we are, home sweet home. Hey, look at this place. You would not expect this from outside, hey? Look at this. It's got like wood floors, it's beautiful. And they have a washing machine. Yeah. Cool, look at this. I think this is a local ambulance. Oh, that is a vintage truck, look at that. England, Europe, Africa, shipping uh, Brazil, Brazil, Sa South America, North America, Canada, Canada, plane, Korea, Korea, shipping, Vladivostok. Vladivostok, Europe, Africa, Brazil, Oh, look what they're doing over there. I don't know, I'm going to ride over and have a look. It looks cute. Cool. And they've got this old Russian van as well. Привет! Привет, как дела? Вон, все нормально. Мы куда и откуда? Now по-русски. No, не по-русски, англий. Angle, angle. Wow, look at this cute houses. <laughs> yeah, we're just coming into this really nice little village. Wow, that looks unreal, really. Nice. Nice. I mean, that looks so incredibly cute. I can't believe they're all painted so nicely. Wow, look at this. Wow. 
I feel like they put a lot of effort in in this village. Yeah, they make it really nice. They do, they make it really, really pretty. And the colours as well, the colours that they've chosen. There's like bright blues, bright greens, bright yellows. <laughs> yeah, that is really, really charming. Really, really charming. Amazing. And we're going to have our waffles with our first view in ages. Look at this. Ta-da! Wow. Look at this. You've got a massive river huge valley with loads of forest you've got the trans-siberian railway just in front what a view hey amazing absolutely amazing the perfect view for a nice waffle break oh yeah Russia saves all the nice landscapes until the very, very end. Yes. And then it's like, oh, by the way, look at this amazing <laughs> valley and this massive river and these massive cliffs. Yeah, wow, that's a really nice ride actually now. Yeah, it just took us six days of riding, hundreds of miles. <laughs> yeah, we've come into some real landscapes now. Yeah, really cool. Yes, this is it. Antipodal point number two. We are here. We have arrived. Ulan Ude. Woohoo! Oh, oh my God. It feels like an absolute lifetime ago that we were at Puerto Natales, but this is it. This is the exact opposite side of the world to Puerto Natales in Chile. Ulan Ude in Russia. Can you believe it? I can't. <laughs> Congratulations! Oh. Yeah! <laughs> wow, that's crazy. Our sightseeing tour of Ulan Ude is going to have to be postponed for a little bit because this morning we have just noticed that we have some oil coming out from our fork here, the right fork. We need to just get the whole area around clean. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. okay, there we go. Good. Wow, look. Yeah, definitely got some dirt on the end of there. Oh yeah, okay. Quite big pieces. All right, so that dirt is basically inside the fork seal and that's most likely what's causing the leak. Yeah, look at that. Definitely got some dirt up in there. You're my mechanic, eh? Hey? Learning new things every day. According to the map, the pier should be just in here. Uh, wait, wait a second. It's okay? No? Close? Maybe let's we can ask him yeah. in Russian where the pier is. Yeah, okay, let's ask. Привет! Привет! Как дела? <laughs> we saw on the map that there was a pier here. Is it possible to see one here? Uh, right. uh, here. Okay, here, here. Yeah. The, the, okay. 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 Okay.
Okay. Okay, nice and easy. Oh yeah, there's loads of cows here. <laughs> How cool is that, hey? Oh, nice. Wow. Oh, there's a load of flies. Oh. Oh my God. Okay, okay, okay. Be careful. Concentrate on the on the road. <laughs> Wait, I gotta close my visor. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, there's something in my helmet. Oh. <laughs> Wait a minute. Whew. Wow, there's a lot of flies here. <laughs> uh, so many flies. Uh, they're coming. Oh. <laughs> okay, no, no, we're keeping our visors on and down. Anyway, more importantly, this lake by cow. Woo! Wow, that is hardly a lake, is it? I mean, wow. that just looks like the ocean. I mean, it's just, it, you can't see anything. It just goes yeah. off off into the distance wow that's really crazy no yeah that's absolutely huge lake by cow hey incredible we finally made it that's wow. crazy <laughs> i'm so happy Ready to leave Russia and head into Mongolia? Yes, I am ready. Oh yeah. Well, anyway, our temporary import permit finishes today, so <laughs> I don't care if you're ready. We're doing it anyway. Yes. We're crossing this border today. We're going to turn off the cameras now because the border time is here. One eternity later. What time is it? Is it five o'clock? Oh my goodness. It's taken us four hours to get to where we are now, I think this is the last barrier. Okay, I'm just gonna turn my camera off. That's it, we're in. Welcome Yay! to Mongolia. <laughs> nice. And look, there's already some gets. That's so cool. Oh, I'm so happy, really. I'm so happy. Oh my God, look at this. <gasps> Whoa. No way. <laughs> There's a whole herd of goats crossing the road. <laughs> a huge herd of goats. Wow. How cute. Oh my God. Oh, and there's wow. the herd of there. Hello. Hello. <laughs> How cute. Oh my God, we're just riding along here and it gets nicer and nicer and nicer. I'm so impressed with Mongolia already. And it's been just like 30 minutes, you know. <laughs> Beautiful mountains. <laughs> Welcome to Mongolia. Oh yeah. <laughs> Amazing. Look at oh. this beauties! Wow! It looks like a little bear, no? Yeah. Hello! Wow, massive! Look how beautiful! He's the champion of, the, of Mongolia. Okay, Ibe is about to ride Mongolia on the box. Mongolia. And... Oh, wow. <laughs> no way. Yeah. That's Mongolia? Yeah. Yeah. Wow. It says Mongols. Mongols. Yes, Mong Mongols. Mongols. Wow, look how many sheep. Wow. And goats. They're just everywhere. There are so many livestock in Mongolia. I think Ipa told us they have like over 70 million livestock here. Wow. Absolutely incredible. Hello, little piggy. That's so funny. Pigs in a car park. Hello. We've got to get to the temple. We've got to go see it. We've got to go through Mongolia. We have to go through Russia. We have to go to Kazakhstan. We have to go all the way around the world. <laughs> oh my God, I think he's losing it. <laughs> it's so beautifully painted, this temple here. And they're just painting it right now as well. You can see them very, very carefully very meditatively. And they're doing an amazing job. It looks so, so good.
got some congestion. Holy crap. <laughs> Sticks. Uh, I think because they go all to the right, we have to go in this lane here. Ah, uh, okay. Yeah, gotcha. Yeah. All right. Okay. 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 Yep. Yeah, I mean congestion is not even a turn anymore for that here. It's yeah. like it's like cars just everywhere here on the road. Yeah. <laughs> everywhere. So we just stopped here on the side of the road to have some lunch, but then a biker passed. And he turned around and check out that bike. Yes. Rosario here from Italy. He's going all the way to Magadan, yeah. right? But what is really funny because we met actually his friend in Patagonia and we got a sticker from him. It's this sticker. And now we're meeting another part of the crew because look here. Yeah. From the same crew, how crazy is that? Welcome Mongolia! Woo! Woo! Yeah. Woo! <laughs> like a mixture of sheep and goats at a picnic yeah <laughs> yes how cute <laughs> oh i love them i love them <gasps> hello guys hello oh the goats are so nice look at this little cuties look at them oh and there are so many as well Oh, so Oli doesn't feel very good. I'm a little bit worried, but we probably have to move on for another hour. Are you my warrior? No. He started this morning to take antibioticum. Hopefully you get better soon. Oh, oh, Upala. Are you stuck or is it okay? I'm stuck. Are you stuck? Yep. I'm stuck. We're gonna have to give, try and give me a push. Yeah, it's pretty sandy around here. Yep, yep, we're going, we're going. Yeah, we're going. Good job there's two of us. If that was me on my own, I would have just, just stayed there overnight. Nice. Wow, let me take a look. <laughs> oh wow, look at that. We made it, happy and alive. Or I made it, happy and alive. <laughs> and Oli made Wee. it happy and half alive. Aww. Beautiful. This is the oldest surviving Buddhist monastery in Mongolia. It's pretty awesome. Waterproof my boots. 
They have a lot of holes now. Olga and Sergey, they gave me actually plastic bags and some tape because it gets quite cold here as well. That's a professional job right there. Wow. So I thought we'd stop off at the mini market and uh, get ourselves a nice juice or something. And also I can show you guys what it looks like on the inside of a Mongolian convenience store in the middle of the mountains. Ta-da! Hello. Hello. <laughs> That's what they got going on. Ooh, what's this? Some little shortbreads. Those look pretty good to be honest. Vodka, 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 vodka. All vodka here, all vodka. In fact, this is all vodka all the way to here. That's like a whole massive corner dedicated to vodka. Hello, <laughs> how are you? Good, good. This one, 5,500. Thank you. Where are you from? I'm from England. England? Yes, thank you. Thank you. That's the nice thing about this country. You can just stop anywhere you want on the side of the road, and go and lie on the grass. That's nice. Do you have um, space for two people? Okay, okay. Yeah? Okay. 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 Yes, around there, yeah? Uh, the last one. Yeah, yeah. Thank okay. you. Okay. Okay. All okay. right. Perfect. <laughs> I think she meant this one. So, so cool. Right next to the lake. Yeah, Unbelievable. Yeah. Okay. Thank you so much. <laughs> I'm so excited. Cool. That looks nice. Hey, it looks cozy. So here it is, Turkin Sagan Lake. It's actually a national park, this lake, and it's one of many massive lakes here in the northern part of Mongolia. It is a spectacular view for the morning and a spectacular ride. Yeah, incredible. I can already feel that today is gonna to be a really nice ride. No way, this is absolutely crazy. But this is all frozen. Wow, I thought it was pretty cold here, hey? <laughs> Don't worry, I'm wearing a helmet. <sighs> wow, no way. That is absolutely crazy. <laughs> Look down here. It's like a mini crevasse. So there's actually still a river running underneath me right now. That is so cool. And another spectacular valley! <laughs> Come on Mongolia, haven't you got anything else except beautifully mind-blowingly stunning valleys? <laughs> I'm on. saturated! No, seriously, it's so spectacular here. So spectacular. The surroundings are just mind-blowing. And then in between you see like this really majestic people on horses, you know? It's just, yeah, wow. Oh my god, look how deep sand this was. Whew. So what's going on in here then? Oh, 
Hello. <laughs> Which meat? Che sheep. Sheep. <laughs> it's sheep. Sheep meat. <laughs> sheep meat. Okay. And the Okay, thank you. Okay. Oh, and the fire ah, is good, yes. very good. Because outside, <laughs> raining, no good. Baisa. So? Baisa. Yes? Yeah. Baisa. Yes. Yeah. 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 It's good. Yes! Bravo! Thank you. Bayeza. 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 Well, this actually looks really good. Good morning. Good morning. We actually had to blow up our mattress and put it on top. Fitted perfectly. Wow! What are you guys cooking? Oh! Carrot, carrot! Oh! It's a marmot! It's a marmot! Oh, it's a marmot! You shot, shot the marmot! <laughs> what? This guy, he shot the marmot with a bow and arrow! No way! That's crazy! We've just stopped on the side of the road because we saw a small herd of camels over here! How cool is that? <laughs> They're all looking at us. They've totally noticed us. <laughs> What a scene, hey? We're going to stop there and have a lunch break next to this massive and beautiful lake. Whee! Oh! 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 A little bit sandy. It looks really sandy. Okay, then I'll just stop where these rocks are. Yeah, let's just maybe just stop here. Okay. <laughs> so we couldn't really get down to the lake, to be honest. <laughs> I thought it was a little bit easier. The material here is like not the easiest to ride on. So, oh, that'll do. That's as close as we're going to get. Okay, my first task is to get back to the road. So Lavi's just walked up to get a good view of me falling over. Okay, let's avoid these prickly bushes. Okay, where am I going to go? Okay, back this way. Ooh, that's a little bit slidey. <laughs> okay, I might need a push. <laughs> okay, ready? Three, two, one, go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Come on, traction by Dunlop. Yes, getting closer, getting closer. Come on, yes. Oh my Lord. How did there happen to be a car coming right as I was about to go up? I didn't realize how soft the ground would be. Okay, ready. Okay, just slowly, we're gonna walk it up, okay? Nearly there. Okay, ready? Three, two, one. Ready? Three, two. Maybe he's gonna help push. Hello! <laughs> Nearly there. <laughs> oh, thank you. Three, two, one, go! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much. Bye, <laughs> Irsa. Nice to meet you. Uh, nice to meet you. <laughs> bye bye. Look at these guys. 
Amazing. Hello, guys. Hello, guys. Oh, cool. Oh, I love them. Ulgi, Ul 70 Ulgi. kilometers. Perfect. Okay, cool. That's where we're going. Perfect. I love how they have a sign and then, like, this is the turn off. <laughs> like this, this is the turn off. Oh so, my goodness. Okay, I'm gonna oh go down God. straight, I think is the easiest. Yeah, perhaps so. Eh? Okay. It's just like, yeah, Ulgi, 70 kilometers this way. Go for it, guys. Okay, so we seem to have lost the track a little bit, but we are heading in the right direction. But here is a sort of track, but it's more of like a trench than a track. So there is no way that I'm gonna take that. Here's some sort of road. I think, yeah, I think follow this road. Follow this one? Yeah, I guess so. Oh my god, there's just tracks everywhere around here. Okay, this one looks a little bit better. So we've just decided to forget all the tracks and we're just driving straight cross country because we can see that there's a bigger road right in front of us, a couple of miles away. This way? This way? Yeah. Okay. So we should hit a track in the minute. Can you already see something? Yeah, I can see some like dugout bits ahead. Let's see. Yeah, yeah, there's something coming up. What's this? Oh yeah, it's here, this one, this one. This one? Yeah. Oh wow, yeah, great. Careful? <laughs> yeah, it's this one. Okay, so it's not really a bigger road at all then? No. <laughs> it's like the same. Bad? Oh no. How big is this stream? I don't think it's big. Wait, should I? No, no, I think it's okay. Yeah, it's fine. Look, I can see the depth. Okay. Woo. Okay. Okay. Yeah. That's uh it's not the it's not the highway I was expecting, but okay. <laughs> wow, yeah, there's really a river. Oh. Okay, so then I gotta climb up there, yeah? Yeah, apparently so. Okay, we get a bit of width, okay. Okay. It's a little bit rough, hey? Eh? Oh my goodness. <sighs> we fell over. I went into a sandy bit in the middle and then we just slid oh. <sighs> damn it oh, let's take the stuff off first hey eh? okay Hello. so let's just take off the pannier yeah, three two one <sighs> okay there's this bit which seems to have ripped Okay, ready? Put the stand down. Okay, three, two, one, go! Okay, good. Yeah, this one on. This, the, the crash bar is bent, but it's okay. Bye, <laughs> Irtha. Faisa. <laughs> How did the Moscow Moto Pannier do? It's got loads of dirt in it, but it seems to have uh, survived. How does that look? Okay. Yeah? <laughs> Thank you. Faisa. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah, it looks okay otherwise. Have ended really, really bad. Careful, careful. <laughs> oh, it's okay. Okay, cool. Oh no! 
Oh no, 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 no. Ah! I am pretty much done for the day. <laughs> Two drops is enough. Two drops is enough for one day. So this day is just going from bad to worse. So look at this sand and look at Bumblebee. And we barely got out of town. You can still see the town in the background. We got like 10 minutes out of town and Bumblebee is on the ground again. Wow, it got really sandy really fast here. It's just really bad, bad road conditions. <sighs> okay, ready? Three, two, one. Okay, ready? Three, two, one. <sighs> Let's try again, because I thought we nearly had that. Three, two, one. Oh, wow. <sighs> Gotta take off the tank bag. <sighs> Also, I did hurt my rib a bit, so I'm not at full strength. <sighs> okay, right, let's try again. Ready? Three, two, one. Okay. <sighs> Nothing broken. At least sand is soft, eh? Might need to push up my back. So would you reckon for just like pitching the tent here? Yeah. This surrounding is spectacular, absolutely spectacular. It is amazing. But I'm very exhausted and ready for bed. <laughs> What an amazing location. We've got our climate tent and our climate chairs to make for the most scenic and most comfortable camp. This, your gear? This. Gear? Your? Yeah? Bonjour. Your? Yes. So these kids just came to say hello to us this morning before we left. Wish us well on the dirt road. Okay, ready? Bye bye! Bye bye! Coming up to a huge herd of sheep and goats. Whoa! Hello guys! <laughs> oh my Hello. god, they're all running. Look at their tails. Yeah. Wow, yeah, they have big fat tails. Oh. <laughs> okay, yeah, yeah, they, they're all thinking, let's go that way. Yes, be careful, there's a little one coming. Yep, yep. Run, 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 run. <laughs> 90 kilometers to go. All right. This road is worse than the one we were just on. <laughs> It's absolutely terrible. Absolutely terrible. I can't believe it. And now for the next 90 kilometers, <laughs> we have to put along here. Oh. But anyway, <laughs> it's an adventure, hey? Oh yeah. our first fall of the day. Ow. Hello. 
Hi. <sighs> okay, three, two, one. Gotta put the stand down. Yeah, okay. Thank you. Thank you. Bye. 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 Yeah, yeah, yeah. This one here. Yeah. Oh damn it. Hold the air. We swap bike. You this one, we this one. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Terrible corrugation now. Oh my god, this road just gets from bad to worse. Seriously. <sighs> Look how much we're shaking around. Yeah. Oh my god. It's like whether it's deep sand or you've got some grip, but it's just shaking the whole bike loose. Uh, it's not easy. <laughs> not easy. Hello. Oh, the water. Hey, that's the water. Uh -huh. Yeah, and what about the silver tape? This one, this one. Yeah. Is uh, gl glue. Uh, super glue. <coughs> yeah. Hot water. Hot water. There's a car coming. Yeah. Maybe they have something better. Oh my God. Yeah. Oh. So you bought some better stuff. We just had this and this. Yeah, thank you. Thank you. So much, yeah. See you. Bye-bye. <laughs> so in other news, our cable tie solution didn't work. So Lavi decided just taking off the mud guy completely for now until we can get a better screw in it. Yeah. We've only done 10 miles. <laughs> Okay, so we just stopped because I heard like a kind of noise and this whole area here is kind of wet with oil. There's oil all in here. It looks like there's a valve here and there's oil coming out of this valve. I don't know why this stuff is coming out there. Yeah, I don't know why stuff is coming out there. Oh no, 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 no! Damn it! Duh! And it's seriously. Look at it! Oh, 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 you hurt my neck. You hurt your neck? You hurt my neck. Oh, because you landed on my head. Oh, no! No! I fell out my shoe. Your shoe fell off. We can't get out of the panniers properly. It's probably just the oil falling onto the exhaust oh, okay. and saying some smoke is coming out. This just became so sandy. Just, just hang on, I'll help. I'm done. I'm really like, I'm done. It's okay, I can do it. If you just press the thing, three, two, one. Why is it stuck? I can't use this shoulder properly. Okay, we're gonna have to just lift it with it. Ready? We're gonna try. Three, two, one, go! Three, two, one, go! Yeah. 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 Okay. It's upright again. Foot pedal's still on. It's just really, really, really annoying because we 
can see some oil is coming out from the suspension then we can hear a noise all the time like a book just rattling hey i think the whole bike is just is just rattling itself apart and then we drop it all the time as well you know it's just not good you know it's not good oh my god okay so Tamag! oh <gasps> what a difference, hey, what a difference. This beautiful river here with the beautiful mountains. Finally, I can look around and take in this incredible landscape. Look ahead, it looks paint. Awesome. No way. Oh, that's awesome. <laughs> yes. <laughs> oh, okay, wait, I just got to stop for a minute. Yeah, let's, let's chill out for a minute, for sure. I just want to stop. Yes. Ah, ah, ah. Ah. Oh, that was really, really hard 50 miles. Wow. Name? Uh, Oli. Norsbuk. Norsbuk. Name? Lavi. England? Germany. Oh, Mongolia. Um, wow, it's got an eagle here. That's yeah. insane. Oh, God, yes. Wow, what's its name? Brukt. 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 Hello, Brukt. Brukt. Hello, hello. Hello, hello Brukt. Uh -huh. ah. Whoa. Uh -huh. You in the ah. boat? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Three, two, one. <laughs> wow, that's crazy. I do with yours. <laughs> Three, two, one. Cool. That's awesome. Wow, that's okay. great. One, two, three. Wow, amazing. What a beautiful creature, oh. hey? So we're getting pretty close to the border now. So we're just going to take off the rear pole just to be safe. All right, we've arrived at the Mongolian side of the border, but the barrier is currently down. I don't know, I guess we'll just wait for the barrier to open and then yeah. we'll start the process. Yeah. So they sent us back to Mongolia. Yeah, they didn't want to let us in. Only joking! Hey, <laughs> welcome to Russia! <laughs> 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 okay, let's jump on. Oy. It still took actually nearly four hours in total yeah. to get through both sides of the border. There's like only two customs officials and there's a huge crowd of people around just trying to give their documents and oh my god it is ruthless at that window <laughs> no there is no queue there's no, nothing no. everybody's just holding their papers and trying to get as close to the window as possible there's no etiquette there's nothing it's just like yeah. people leaning up against people i had a woman with her face like two inches from my face and she didn't care she had her papers ready when that window <laughs> opens and the customs guy gets his hand for the next paper she was going to be there she was going to be ready <laughs> so i gave the papers to lavi and she was just like bah, bah, bah. <laughs> Hand through all everybody like yes get the papers to the front. <laughs> oh my god. It was absolutely mad Wow, it's so beautiful here. What a cool road. It's just so peaceful Hey knowing that the road is at the moment really good that I can't feel the suspension. <laughs> yeah after yesterday or the day before lots of negatives then yeah. today a few positives yes exactly yeah it's really crazy because every traveler told us oh my god the altai area is so beautiful and wow we are just like 10 miles into this journey here and it's just incredible we've only like ridden for an hour and it's already just it's absolutely picturesque here really impressive Wow, 
Wow, that is a crazy mountain vista ahead. Look at that. Unbelievable. Yeah, wow, that's a lot of snowy mountains. So we just stopped here on the side of the road because I saw the word archaeological and we translated the like info board at the front and apparently here there is a ancient rock carving of a deer which is two and a half thousand years old. There's so many of them. When you look in detail, yeah. you can see so many of them. Cool, wow. It's a whole herd. Look at the selection of teas that they're selling here. Oh my God, that's a lot of different tea. I just love the smell, you know? I thought the English were like the tea connoisseurs, but no, apparently the Russians. Nice. Woo -hoo, some kind of valley, hey? Wow. Incredible. It just doesn't stop, you know? It just keeps going and going and going. The river just keeps getting bigger and bigger and bigger as we go along. Привет. Как дела? Хорошо. Хорошо, Juice, yeah. I don't know the word for juice, I'm afraid. Okay, you got some breads, yep. Oh, what's that? Very brown bread, yeah. Good. Yeah. Good. Oh, counting everything with an abacus. Is she actually using it? Or is she using the calculator? No, she did move it. It's like... <laughs> cool, yes. Here it is, bison parking. Cool. Oh, the info board is only in Russian. I think we're going to have to Google Translate that one. Hoop, hoop. Okay. Oh, yeah. Amazing, look at that. They're absolutely huge. They're really, really big eyes. Wow. Oh, I just touched the bison on the nose. Wow, this is absolutely massive. Look at his head. Wow. <laughs> okay, I'm sorry about earlier, okay? Here's an apple to make up for it. He's like, I accept your apology. Ooh. Yeah, we got the tent set up. We got the tent set up. We got the tent set up. Half for me to dance with my ribs. River Katyi or Kat Katyir, Katyir. Ta da! Oh, wow, look at that. Wow. Yeah, that's a big, fast-flowing river coming straight down from the glaciers. Yeah, I mean, can't get better than that. Yeah, amazing. I mean, this is just the land of mountains, forests, rivers, and bears. This is Siberia, baby. I had to do a quick turn around to show you guys this place. Look at this. It's an upside down house. What is going on? Oh, that's really, really funny. Do you want to have a look inside? Oh, cool. 
So this is the kids' room. Wow, nice. Oh, that's so cool. Oh. Oh. Look, the whole building is like on an angle. It's kind of freaky, hey? Yeah, it's weird, hey? It's like gravity is off the bedroom. Oh, wow. It's totally weird when you stand and you just see the room. <sighs> Bumblebee is still bleeding. I thought actually all the oil was gone already, but apparently Bumblebee is still dripping oil. It's really, really bouncy now. <laughs> Look at that. Oh man. All wrapped up. Ready to go. I'm not really ready to go, but I'm gonna go anyway. Bed this way. <laughs> okay, bed this way. That's exactly yes. what we want. Exactly. And come on, there's like nobody here. There's like two cars and one truck. If they don't have space for us, then they don't build hotels properly in Russia, is all I can say. <laughs> Seriously. Privet. Как дела? Anglais, Germania. Germania. Oh. <laughs> hey, not good to meet you. We saw you there on the sign. Oh, it's Vinici, now for now for Ruski. Now for Ruski. Party man. Party man. I don't know. You pa party. Pa party man. Party man. Party man. Под дождь попали, под дождь. А, попали? А мы попали по очень сильный дождь. У нас рыло и рыло там. Ну молоденький, молоденький. Братушка. Спасибо. Вам вам спасибо, вам спасибо. <laughs> yes, they had a room for us, thank God. Today is actually a really, really special day because we're crossing into Kazakhstan and that means we are not overstaying our Russian visa. We had to apply for this Russian visa a year ago and this visa just expires in a few days. Today represents the last day in a long struggle to make it here before this visa expired. <laughs> oh my God. Oh, it's been really, really, really difficult physically and mentally. We haven't had a lot of rest recently because we've just had to keep going and going and going, basically fighting the days. Yeah, it was a hell of a ride, hey? <laughs> we were apprehensive about going into Russia in the first place, considering the global situation at the moment. I'm really happy that we did it because it was absolutely uh, incredible to ride through. Yeah, it wasn't what I expected at all and I'm really glad that we did it. So the mission for today is to cross the border, get into Kazakhstan and reach the city of Seme where we are really gonna have a much needed rest. We're finally out of Russia. Yay! So now we're just waiting in line to enter Kazakhstan. We're back at the front in front of the barrier so yeah let's see how long it takes before we can get in and get this process sorted. It's currently coming up to half three and we arrived at the border at half past twelve so it's taken us a little while. And we are on the road. <laughs> Welcome to Kazakhstan! <laughs> we made it! Oh, oh my god! Let me talk about the Russian side of the border because that was the real time consuming side. When we went to the passport control and gave them the passports, of course, we had to wait at the side. And then when everybody else had left, they took us into an interview room and then started asking us all the questions for the third time. Where are we going? Where have we been? They wanted our phone, UK phone numbers. They even got our IMEIs from both of our phones. I don't know what they 
they did with our IMEI numbers, but they wanted to find out some stuff about us. I was just sweating, you know, I was just, oh my God, like how long are gonna this take? And what are they doing? And do they have to call the police now? And you know, in your head, you just create the story of like, now it's over. We were just in that room. We couldn't leave, we couldn't go to the bathroom. We couldn't do anything. If they wanted to just detain us for one reason or another, you know, they could have just done it. But at the end of the day, they were quite nice. He gave us our passport bags. He said, I wish you great travel. And he smiled at us and, and that was it. So we are still in Sami. Um, we decided to go actually to the hospital, even though we are already in the hotel for like five days. The first translation I had was that there were seven fractured ribs. And I was like, seven fractured ribs. And then they said, no, 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 rib seven is fractured, like the seventh one down. They said it's a really uncomplicated fracture and there's nothing really to do except to take pain medication, and keep doing breathing exercises. They also said that it's not going to cost me anything. They said it's completely free of charge, which I have no idea why, but it's amazing. And these are the awesome doctors here yeah. from the hospital. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. The road is absolutely terrible. Terrible. I'm like going 27 miles an hour now. And I literally can't go faster. Otherwise oh. we shake uncontrollably and the back wheel hits underneath Lavi's seat. Not fun at all. Oh, hello. Yes, it is a shop. Let me see what they've got. They've got crisps, chocolate croissant in a packet. Got some quail eggs in the fridge. So this is our supermarket special from this little shop here. Got some bread, mayonnaise, and then this pot of stuff that we could not translate. We kept asking him, is it cheese? Is it yogurt? What is it? We couldn't translate it, so we just bought it. It's mustard. Who'd have known, eh? So we're having mustard, mayonnaise, and crisp sandwiches. So the price was something like 2,500, which is like five pounds. And when we went to pay, we just had 5,000 notes. And he said, I don't have any change for that. So then he wanted to give us the whole shop for free. He said, just take it. And we were like, no, 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 we can't just take it. After we gave him the 5,000, he just started grabbing other things. And he's like, take this, take this, take this, take this. So in the end, we ended up with a lot more than we originally planned on getting. Welcome to <laughs> Thank you so much. Thank you. It was really nice to see you, to meet you. Perfect! Thank you so much! Oh my god. It's not very funny. Because now it's like maximum speed is 20 miles an hour. Yeah, this road got so much worse after that town. You know, even cars, they're just bouncing around as well. Yeah. Everything's bouncing around on this road, but yeah. we're like bouncing double. 20 miles an hour is my max speed. 20. Yeah. <laughs> and I'm still bottoming out the wheel. I can still hear it hitting underneath. At this rate is going to take us at least another three, three and a half hours. We really can't go any faster. We can't. I'm just hoping that Bumblebee survives the day. If you want to know what's the worst road we have driven so far on our journey, it's this road. I just can't believe it. It looked so alright on the paper, like it was just straight one corner and then straight. Just exhausted. Hello. Uh, England. <laughs> Good enough for me. The salads arrived already. I got a really nice salad here. 
and here's some like fried aubergines with an egg and uh, tomato. My body is just craving vegetables so much. My body is craving cheese, burek and pizza, so <laughs> that's what I've got coming. A few moments later. Yes, now we're talking. Oh, the main course has arrived. Look at these. This is burek and it's just filled with cheese. It's just amazing. <laughs> Welcome to Koilik. <laughs> Welcome to Koilik. And there's a huge herd of cows coming down the road. A bit of a cattle drive going on. I'm just going to see if I can get around these guys. Not sure. <laughs> we'll be like a little bit of a slalom um, ride here. Yeah, do you think I should just kind of go between them? Oh, where this car just came from, I should go there. Don't hit them. No, no, I'm going to try not to. Nice, look at that, hey? It's awesome. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they seem pretty chilled. <laughs> Cow slalom. <laughs> nice. Okay, so this place, hey? Yeah. I mean, it looks like they might have some rooms. Okay, so the place is a hotel and it does have rooms. And this is Janat. Janat. <laughs> Janat. Altai Cafe. Altai Cafe. Oh, spasiva, spasiva. Our lifesaver. Yes. <laughs> yes. I'm really glad they had a room. Let's get some juice for Bumblebee. Whoop. 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 Yep. Okay. So we filled up 12.6 liters uh -huh. and it cost us 2,597 tenge. Okay. Four pounds 46. What? <laughs> That's so cheap. Kazakhstan is the cheapest country. Wow. Okay, so hold on. 205 per litre. How much is that? 35 pence a litre. Whoa. Salam. The time? <laughs> wow, he came over and crossed the road just to find out the time. Wait, why does he need to know the time? I don't know. Do you think they bring their herd like to certain pastures at certain times? I thought it was just like go wherever they want. Yeah. All right, we are finally here in the city of Almaty. And Bumblebee didn't break down. Congratulations on Bumblebee. Yeah, I, I cannot believe it. We have really the strongest bike in the world. <laughs> Going with a broken suspension for about 1,500 miles probably. Yeah. Whoa, look at this place. Hello. Hey, Oli, nice to meet you. What's your name? Misha. Misha, Misha, nice to meet you. This is very cool here. I like it. The last floor. It is actually the last room of the last building on the last floor. Whoa, that's new, isn't it? Oh. Let me see the view. Whoa. Whoa, that's crazy. Okay. Let me show you why it's so heavy in this box. What is this, guys? This is a rear shock for Bumblebee. Uh. <laughs> okay, cool. Hello, hello. <laughs> yeah. 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 <laughs> Oli, nice to meet you. Alib. Alib. And this one, Bumblebee. <laughs> Whoa, look how long the end of it is. Wow. That's a really, really cool little scooter. What year? Na oh, 1975 yeah. scooter from Russia. Wow. Cool stuff. It's already taking Bumblebee apart. <laughs> Bumblebee with Autoshock. Ah. Absolutely crazy. So this is Andre from the Nomad Almaty Motorcycle Club. Thank you so much for having us here. I am so relieved. You know, it's just a really nice place to go to, to meet some other awesome bikers and relax for a while whilst others do the job. <laughs> <laughs> yes. So let's try it out, hey? Let's try out the new shock. <laughs> let's do it. It's <laughs> good, no? Look at that. 
Bravo. Spasiba, spasiba. Opa. Yep. Yes. Woo! Bumblebee is alive. Good to go. Okay, shall we? Нет, нет, она они не знают, как он Okay, so what is this? Kurt. Kurt. It's a uh, dried uh, milk with salt. Cow's milk or? Cow's milk. Cow's milk. Dried cow's milk with salt. Salted. Okay, you can try first. <laughs> no, you try first, my love. Okay. <laughs> mm. This one is good. Mm. This one is good. Because mm. made for, for uh, tourists, not so salty, not so sour. You say not, not so salty, not what? so sour. And she's like, it's really salty and really sour. 2006, 700. We can make it to the top. We can make it to the top. That's it. Yay! You did it. Is this the top already? Yes. Yeah. Yes. This is the dam, yeah? We're getting pretty close to the border to Kyrgyzstan now. Okay, this is it. You can see up ahead, control point. Yeah, do you think we should go in this line or on that line? Oh, oh, it's green. This line, obviously. <laughs> 20 minutes later. So that's it. We just crossed through into Kyrgyzstan and it's only 20 past 10. Can you believe it? Wow. Welcome to Kyrgyzstan. <laughs> Thank you very much. <laughs> I really like your hat. Yes, Kalpak. Kalpak. Kyrgyz traditional. Okay. Yes, okay. formal, formal okay. traditional. Yes. Wow. Yeah, your boots are amazing. Yes. Look at that. <laughs> <laughs> Looks like the start of the mountains. Yeah, absolutely stunning. The mountains have really started to spring up around us now. There's a giant eagle. Awesome. Amazing. Wow, look at this place. Hello, horsies. Oh yeah, wow, there's horses everywhere. Wow, amazing, absolutely amazing. Wow. wow, here we are, this is it. Cool, look, people are swimming. Lake is it cool, ladies and gentlemen. Cool. Look at this. Amazing. <laughs> Hi. Hi. <laughs> wow, cool, amazing place. Oh, nice. how about, how about we pitch up here? Okay. All right. Our first Kyrgyzstan camels! Amazing! Oh, so cool, hey? Yeah, what a beautiful scene. <laughs> wow. Yeah, this is just a stunning place. Wow. Look at all these mountains around. It's absolutely beautiful. Wow. Wow, what a landscape. That's stunning. That is crazy. <laughs> wow. We've got some little patches of snow up on the hills at the top there. Just a crazy, crazy road go through this landscape. Wow. Amazing. Welcome to Kyrgyzstan. <laughs> what a nice country. Wow. It's sort of turning into a rocky mountain track. 
Yeah. So yeah. Yeah, I mean, if this part was like a good part, then I really don't want to know how the other parts are. Hello guys. There's a whole herd of yaks up here. Amazing, look at these fluffy, cute guys. I can see as well where the road goes. Oh my god, we are going up, up, up. I think it, yeah, it passes over there, doesn't it? Yeah. Oh my god. Oh my lord. Okay. Hey, it wasn't that adventurous. Totally. <laughs> I am still loving the life. First views of Songkul Lake ahead of us. Yeah. That is amazing. Yeah, we successfully managed to climb up the pass and now we are on a quite high elevation. The bike's recording 11,000 feet at the moment and then we're dropping down a little bit to get down to the lake. But yeah, that climb was a little bit hairy at times, hey? Yeah, totally. But once yes. you get back on this road, you're like, oh, that's not too bad. That's nice. These are the more enjoyable moments. Once you've come over the pass, you've got the views and you're just on your way down, hey? Yeah. So we just go up here? Yeah, in between all the horse poo. <laughs> yeah, let's try and find a bit where there's no horse poo. <laughs> we'll make our own yurt for tonight, won't we? It looks so cozy. so much sweetheart. It's so sunny this morning. Wow. Bumblebee is making friends. <laughs> A Kyrgyzstan roadblock. <laughs> oh yeah, go on, all cross now. Yeah, no problem. <laughs> Yo! Wow, look at this views! Wow, we just came up and over a little pass and this looks like a crazy road down ahead. Oh my god, it does. So we're gonna be going around here and then yit 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 down. Yeah, down baby. Wow, crazy. Wow. Honestly, it looks like a painting here. Look, it just goes down and down and down. Yes. Wow. Yes, I don't know where it's going to, man. <laughs> I don't know, that's where we're going. We're going down there. Wow. What, what, what? Yes. What happened? Oh, no. Okay, hold on, I'm coming to the side. Okay, so ladies and gentlemen, 
the drone has crashed again. <laughs> Let me go and get it. <laughs> I see it. I see it. I see it. I see it. Let's see if we've got any rotor blade broken or anything broken. Oh, okay. Can I grab it? Okay. Yes. The drone is still working. Let's try camera down. Yes. Camera up. Yes. Do a little spin around. Oh, it's great. Oh, it's still working. Yes. Whew. That's good. Good news. The drone will live to fly another day. Wow. <laughs> With a heart. Wow, cool. <laughs> I just wonder like how much of this way is going to be like this, you know? Yeah, I know. We managed to have a check on Google Maps. We got a little bit of signal and it seems like the way that we're going now is a hundred miles to Kazarman and the way that we could have gone on the dirt road was 60 miles to Kazarman. We just asked a local uh, on a bike actually, he came past and he's like, oh, four hours. And that's what they said at the beginning. They yes. said like, oh, four hours to Kazarman and then he's yes. like, four hours to Kazarman. So yes. Yes. I don't know, we've made like 20, 25 miles yeah. out of a hundred. So we've got a long way to go. Climbing up, up, up. Yeah, climbing, climbing, yeah, wow. 40 miles to go! <laughs> oh my lord! Whoa, look at this on the other side! Epic man! Epic! Yeah, totally, look at that! I feel like we could almost just kind of... Go straight! Right? Go straight, yeah! Oh yeah, there we go! It was bound to happen, wasn't it, eventually? Uh, the stupid mudguard screw is gone again. <sighs> yeah, nearly there. <laughs> oh, there it is. Kazarman! <laughs> we made it! Oh, speed bump. Oh, wee! Wow. And look what we've got here in Kazarman. Tarmac! Bossies. Good morning, guys. <laughs> oh no, oh no, we're hurting oh. them. <laughs> Sorry. Oh, wow, they are beautiful horses. Look at them, look at their coats. Wow. Yeah, amazing horses. Oh, wow, go. got corrugation. Yeah. Oh. Come on, Bumblebee, you can do it. Oh, rock. Oh, sorry. <laughs> sorry, Bumblebee, for everything we put you through. <laughs> yeah. Suzuki, Suzuki, <laughs> Suzuki. <laughs> oh, wow, look at this. Hold oh. on a minute. I'm going to have to go through because I'm not going to the edge. Okay. Oh, wow. Okay. okay, I'm just, again, I just have to go through. Yep. Oh! Wow! Oh, that was deeper than I imagined. Whew. Jesus. <laughs> We've definitely had a lot of rain here. Wow. Wow. Oh my God. Let's hope that the other side of the mountain is a bit drier. Yeah. Oh, no, look at this. Oh my God. Okay. Okay, no, this is a little bit. Oh. Yeah, that's a bit dodgy, that was. Oh, wow, yeah. Okay, that was pretty. That, that was, was dodgy, definitely. Yeah, it was definitely hitting, hitting the back tire, very hard. Oh, very good, very good, ah. very good, very good, very good. That was man. Ah, oh, it started hailing. Luckily, we are wearing our helmets. Oh. Not good at the moment, not good. It's terrible weather to be up here. Oh yeah. man. <laughs> okay, that's all right. 
it yet. Yep. We've got literally no visibility anymore. It's like, look at this, this is crazy. I can hardly tell where the edge of the cliff is and where the road is. Kind of ridiculous. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh yes. I think we are at the top of the pass. Look at this. Yeah, we Sun made it. We didn't die. <laughs> sunshine on the other side. Yeah, the weather's much better on the other side. There's pretty much sunshine over there. Look at that. This is where we're heading, hey? That's where we're headed. Yeah. Yeah, we're going all the way along and heading out that way. This is it. This is our highest point and the weather's looking a lot better on the other side. Yeah. And look, the sheep's coming to say hello. Yeah, wow. That's so nice. <laughs> Hi, guys. Oh, I'm so glad that we got past that bit. Man, ash. <sighs> yeah. We made it! We made it to the top. Beautiful. Look at all these beautiful horses. Beautiful. And his wife's just a little boy. <laughs> Let's see if we can just get through here without killing a yeah. foal. I think so too. What do you think? Shall I just go? Um I don't know. It looks like it's been washed out. Do you think it's for me better to walk and you try to to ride it because I think it will be really um Yeah yeah it's gonna be muddy. Muddy. It's gonna be really muddy. Yeah yeah, maybe it's best. It's basically just from here to there. Yeah. And it looks like they're cutting it out at the moment. Yeah. I'm not even sure I can go yet. Wow, they're really carving it all out right now. I'll ask him if I can go. He said I he said I can go. Okay. Yep. Okay. Oh Lord. Okay. Yep. Wow. Oh my God. Woo. Oh. Yeah, I think that's it. Short but intense. Okay. I didn't fall over. So we've just noticed that we've actually lost one of the rollers. This one here. And this is the same thing that happens back in Chile. And um, it started with one, then it was two, three, four, five. So this doesn't look really good for the chain. We'll most likely need to replace the chain and the sprocket at some point pretty soon. All right, I think we're getting pretty close now. We've got a whole line of trucks, standard border. Oh, wow, it's like right in front of us, I think. Oh, okay. Maybe let's just turn off the cameras. Yeah. Two hours later. Welcome to Kyrgyzstan! <laughs> oh no! So we are back in Kyrgyzstan. I wish I could have recorded some of that, but that would have made the situation much worse than it was, which was pretty bad already. We found our two drones. Yeah. <laughs> Apparently drones are illegal in Uzbekistan. Yeah. We're going to head back to Osh now and uh, try and figure out what we're going to do about these drones because we can't go through Uzbekistan with these drones. Yeah, massive bummer. Look, there's a whole bunch of horses going down the road. <laughs> 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 what the hell? <laughs> Oh 
yeah, we're coming back into the mountains now. Beautiful. So glad that we didn't go into Uzbekistan and that we actually went up this way now because wow I mean look at this river color it's so bright this valley way that we're on right now is just it's just insane look at the yeah. landscape yeah these wow. crazy rocky canyons and the color of the water it's just so vibrant it's incredible this way is so incredible <laughs> wow yeah, Kyrgyzstan has a lot of nice places to offer, for sure. We're living life to the max. Riding around the world doesn't have to be a chore, you know. <laughs> You're so black on your nose. Why? From your leather gloves, I think. No. Not down there, I think. Oh my lord. <laughs> no, actually, I think still up here. Okay, no, we do have to go down here at least. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. It's a little bit less of a road now. Oh my god. It's okay. Okay, there is a little bit of sand here. Hold on a minute. Let's try and get away from it. Oh, this is gravelly. Look at this. Always hard to find the nice welcome spots, eh? <laughs> if you want the spot, you've got to do the road. Wait a minute before I go down that bit. I think I will walk it actually because it looks really... <laughs> so which way am I gonna go? I think I'll just go like straight down the middle. It's not deep sand I think. Here? No. I'll see you at the bottom. Nice, look at this. Talk to cool reservoir. Nice. Yeah, this is going to be a nice camping spot, eh? Okay, everything's kind of packed up. <laughs> but anyway, it's time to go in the water.
think like nothing can surprise you anymore and then you turn the corner and you have something like this hey these beautiful mountain yurts <laughs> Such peaceful living, hey. Totally. I really want to live in a yurt. Yeah, maybe that's an idea for the future. Yurt camp in Scotland. <laughs> there we go. So we just reached the top. Otmok Pass, 3,326 meters. Lavi and Ollie sticker going on the pass. Nice. There you go. Forever happy and alive. <laughs> Cool, amazing. <laughs> this hot tea, hot tea. is us present. Okay, oh, thank, thank you. you. Yeah, That's really That's kind. Very, very kind. Thank you. Yes. Thank you. Thank you so much. Rachman. Rachman. How friendly, hey? <laughs> I think this is it. The Kazakhstan border. You. Hello. Okay. Camera no, no camera. No, no, no. Thank you! Svasiba Rachmed! Jane! Front sprocket and back sprocket. No way. Let me see. Ha -ha! There she is! So guys, we just received a message and it was literally a picture of Bumblebee yeah. outside of our apartment block. <laughs> Bumblebee's here, but I don't know where Kirill is. Oh, hi. Hi, Bumblebee. Ah, Asiva, thank you. Ira. Ira. Oli. Очень приятно. Oli. Ira, nice to meet you. Lovely. Nice to meet you. The bike looks amazing. <laughs> amazing. Oh my god, yes. This one here is apparently cheese. Capchon is I mean, can't get better, hey? <laughs> Hold on a second, we might be uh, flat. One second. Oh no! Wait. Oh no! Oh, hold on. Oh no! Yeah, maybe we're flat. I think our battery is flat. Yeah. yeah. Okay. So we might need to yeah. jump it. Turn off or they stopped us. Okay. Hello. Hello. Hi. <laughs> uh, uh, good day. <laughs> good day. Uh, okay. <laughs> uh, well, this is me, yes, yes, yes. Uh, here, Kiz Lorda, a Aiteki B. Yeah. Ah, okay. 
Okay. Okay, me sit sitting. Okay. Okay. You never shake it. Never shake. You never shake it. Never shake this one. Huh? How to show? How to show? Спасибо. Foto. Ah, foto. One, two, three. Rahmed, Rahmed. Rahmed. Bye, bye. Three hundred twenty-four miles. Yeah, okay. <laughs> <laughs> that was a bit strange, wow. wasn't it? <laughs> I think it's a new record. Yeah. We just rode past the place where the first man in space launched from and the first object in space. So we basically thought, okay, right, let's just ride to the place and just see if we can go in and, and check it out. We got to the front entrance and we said, oh, hey, we want to come in and have a look around. And the guys were just like, no, not possible. <laughs> yes, no way. <laughs> The closest we could get was the entrance, but they did have a really cool display in front of the entrance where they showed a few like mock-ups of some rockets and there was a replica of Sputnik 1, the first ever object that humans launched into space. So at least we could see that, which was still pretty cool and it's still a pretty special place to be. Yeah, totally. Yeah. Chips for breakfast <laughs> or a nice roast dinner? Yes. No, no, no. Just two? Me two. Okay. <laughs> Tourist, da? <laughs> Duo. Duo. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> okay. Thank you, Rahmet. So we are here and we're getting ever closer to our target here in Kazakhstan, Aktau. And today we're going to be taking this road to the city of Aktobe before taking this road south and towards the Caspian Sea. Now it really is the home stretch and we are heading now towards the Caspian Sea to get the bike and get ourselves across to Azerbaijan. I'm just super super excited because actually it looks like that we will make it back to England and that we will make it to get the Guinness World Record, which is absolutely amazing. So this is actually the last tricky bit we have to figure out because at the moment the land borders in Azerbaijan are still closed. At the moment the idea is to put Bumblebee on a boat to Azerbaijan and then for us we may have to fly into Azerbaijan because you are allowed to fly in. You are just not allowed to cross any land borders. And then we will go to the port and pick up Bumblebee and continue from there. Yeah, and although the land border to come in is closed, uh, apparently you can still exit. So then we're going to be heading to Georgia and then to Turkey and then on to Europe. Yeah. But for today, we've got a long road. We're hoping to get to Aktau in three rides from here but each ride is gonna be a pretty long one. So yeah, we're just gonna kinda of get the cruise control on and see how far we can get. So we're just stopping for our lunch break and I just wanted to show you guys the beautiful cemeteries they have here in Kazakhstan. It's crazy, it's like a whole city. Yeah, let's check out the one in there. Okay. Wow, look at that. It's like a labyrinth. It is. It's safe. 
Yeah, look at this one. Wow. Massive. It's pretty amazing. Wow. And it's so extensive as well. Like it goes off in all directions. Look at that. Wow. And seriously, we saw already hundreds of cemeteries like that. The reality of riding around the world. Oli is pretty dead, actually. We did a hundred miles already. So now we have just a hundred more to go. I said to Oli, like, let's just pitch up the tent here. But he doesn't really like the idea. I think it's a bit too windy for camping. So I think we just got to keep going and get to this room and have a cookie. Okay, let's say hello to this one. To this guy, yeah? yeah. Okay. We've seen these guys so many times riding past hello. that I just want to be their friend. Hello. Do you think we should give them some? Yeah, yeah, that's a nice one. Mmm, I would eat that. What is he doing? He wants something to eat. Do you like this one? Hey? <laughs> 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 I don't know if he wants it. Do you want this one? I'm not sure what he wants. <laughs> wow, look how big his eyes are. Yeah, wow, beautiful animal. Oh, he's trying to eat it. Give him some grass. He's trying to eat you. <laughs> he wants to eat my hands. <laughs> Come on, eat the grass. It's a nice piece of grass. It's a nice bit. Oh, I don't think that he likes this one. We should have gotten like carrots or something. Yeah, they probably would prefer some carrots or something nice. Look, he's eating the <gasps> same thing that we just offered him. Mm. This is a really nice one. I love him. Look at them, they're so yes, lovely. They're so lovely. They seem quite friendly as well. Yeah. Oh, what a nice camel. What a, what a nice camel. What a nice camel. What a nice camel. Oh, he's a nice camel. Oh, he's a nice camel. Wow, he's so lovely. Oh, you're so nice. Wow, he's so big as well. I can't believe how big they are. I can feel him swallowing. I can feel his throat when he swallows the grass. It's like glunk. See, I told you we can make friends with them. I mean, it does say hotel and here is a cafe. So Okay, yeah, let's see. I guess that's the right place. And the place. door's open. And the door is open. Yeah. <laughs> and there's a bottle of vodka on the ground outside. So these guys just came to say hello and they've got LTM 200s. Very nice. Whee! Nice. So this is our room. Um, not the nicest room but it was only three pounds so What is our estimation? 69 miles. Okay. Apparently. Do you want to look for fuel there? Thank you. Um, what do you think if we ride slow now? Can we make it? It's like 70 miles. Okay, I think we can make it. Yeah, okay, let's, let's just do it. So this is the first time I have ever seen the estimation go into single digits. It's estimating that we have nine miles left in the tank. 
But no worries, because we are here. We have reached the town of Steppe with a whole nine miles still to go. Oh my God, really? <laughs> <laughs> I don't like that too much. My palms are sweaty, bike going slow, tank is empty. <laughs> There's no petrol stations anywhere. Um, <laughs> I can't think. I'm not a born rapper. Oh, look at this, we're coming through an oil field. Look at these machines. Wow. Cool. Oh, look at this. Big pipes. Oh, look. There it is, the Caspian Sea. Nice. Nice. So we're just getting our visa for Azerbaijan. So now it's on to trying to get Bumblebee on a boat over to Azerbaijan. So we found a company on iOverlander that are shipping motorcycles for something like 100, 110 US dollars, which is a pretty good price. So we're just gonna buy some tickets now for later this week. Woohoo! <laughs> Hello. Uh, hello. Ah, oh, no, no camera. Okay, so customs is all done. All the check-in is done. Everything's done, basically. So then I asked the guy, I said, okay, what do I do now? And he said, oh, sleep, sleep. I was like, sleep? What do you mean sleep? And then using Google Translate, he basically told me, the ferry will arrive between four and five tomorrow morning. And I was like, okay, so can I just leave the bike here and somebody puts it on the ferry? He says, no, no, we have no people here at the port who can do that. So basically you have to wait. And when the ferry arrives, you have to load it on yourself. So it's currently 10 p.m. That means I have now about six hours to wait here. Basically wait for this ferry to arrive. Hopefully, if I do sleep, somebody will wake me up when the ferry arrives. Good night. Oh my God, guys, you won't believe it, but I've actually been called to ride Bumblebee onto the ferry. Yes! It's nearly 11 o'clock now, well and truly into the next day. Socks and sandals all the way. It's too heavy. We do it together. Okay. No, no. Okay, you know what? One second. One, okay. two, three, go. Oh, oh. Ready? Yo. Three, two, oh, one. Go. Two and four, fire. Bella. Hot, 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 man. Azerbaijan, we're coming. So we just jumped in a taxi here from a local service called Bolt. 
and this is our taxi driver <laughs> and it says on the GPS that the ferry port is uh, just over an hour away so in one hour we're going to be reunited with Bumblebee That right there is one of the UNESCO World Heritage Sites of the city, the Maiden Tower, as part of Baku's Old City. It's a really beautiful city. Soksaol! Soksaol! Yes, we've arrived! It's a little bit nerve-wracking to be honest because I read reports on iOverlander that this port is notorious for people stealing stuff from the vehicles whilst they're waiting to be collected and Bumblebee has been here in the port for a week. It's a little bit nerve-wracking. Anyway, I can see Bumblebee up ahead. Let's see how she looks. I think everything's there. One pannier, one box, two helmets, spider web, tank bag. Yeah, it looks like everything is here, which is amazing. Goodbye, goodbye, Azerbaijani police. <laughs> goodbye to Alat Ferry Port. Oh, goodbye, it was a nice time here. Was it? <laughs> <laughs> oh, we are finally out. Bumblebee is free. Yes. <laughs> Oh man, that was a bit of a process, I can tell you. It's taken us five hours to get Bumblebee free. Just eight miles away from here is a super cool area with some mud volcanoes, which I've never seen before in my life. So that's going to be super cool. But I'll tell you guys more about them when we get there. Whoa, look at this. What the hell? I wonder if we can touch it or not. Wow! Oh. Look! <laughs> Look, there's like one, two, three, four. That's so cool. <laughs> no way! Whoa! <laughs> Sweetheart, what are you doing? This is like some free, really expensive skincare routine. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> you like it? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Actually, the name Azerbaijan means land of the holy fire. Wow. Amazing. Oh, nice. <laughs> you look like you're walking on another planet. Married in Las Vegas. Oh. We. Oui. You went there by bike. Uh, yes. Oh. <laughs> How long are you in the tour? We started one, one, one and a half years ago. One and a half years. Okay. Yes. So all the best. Yes. Thank you so much. Thank you. Come to India. We come to India next year. You're loading on this every every day. Every day ride is on YouTube. YouTube. Yes. You have to uh, subscribe. Yes. <laughs> Thank you. thank you so much guys oh nice to meet you thank you thank you he's with the bike <laughs> India. 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 Germany, England. <laughs> welcome, welcome. 
<laughs> yes. Amazing. This is apparently the national dish. I don't know the name, but it's stuffed peppers. What is the name for the national dish? This one? Dolma. 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 Okay. Peter. And in turn, beef. Yeah, yeah. And this is the national dish, Azerbaijan. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Wow, cool. Look at the condition of Bumblebee. No, no, look at Bumblebee. Oh. Everything is so messed up. Oh, I hate this road. So we've just stopped here in this beautiful forest area. Look at this. Chai? Chai? Okay. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> okay, okay. Cheese, 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 cheese. Hey. Amazing. Name, name. Name. Love you. Love you. Love you. Uh, Oliver. Married. Married? Yes! <laughs> Your name? Okay, name you. Seville. 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 Nice Seville. to meet you. Nice. Very nice, Seville. Ah. Ribiata, Bebe. No? Bebe. No, no. 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 After. No. After. 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 No. no space. No space. Baby, yes, no. Baby, no. Very good. Very good. Very good. I've got to take a look at this river. It looks crazy. Whoa, look at this. <gasps> Whoa. Whoa. That was some serious rain yesterday. I never saw a black river like that. Yeah. Ever in my life. I never saw anything like that. I mean, it looks like oil is just floating down here. Whoa. Wow, that's absolutely crazy. Look over there. Okay, now I'm convinced that Azerbaijan is just the land of animals crossing the road. <laughs> Seriously, this is a group of turkeys. <laughs> Hello, Hello guys. guys. Whoa, that's crazy. So we've had geese, we've had sheep, we've had cows, and we've had turkeys. And humans. All right, I think we are arriving at the Azerbaijan Georgia border. Yeah, let's check it out, hey? So I guess this river here separates the border between Azerbaijan and Georgia because we have just been stamped out. Bumblebee has been let out of the country, which is awesome. And now, as you can see right in front, we're about to enter Georgia. Can you believe it, hey? <laughs> Happy days! Nice. Happy days! Happy days, Which happy country days. is this? Number 30? Maybe. Possibly country number 30 on yeah. our round the world trip. Yeah. Oh, cool. Oh, okay. How do you say, Georgia? Sacatolo. Sacatuelo. Okay. There he is, Mr. Mark Travels. Nice. How's it going? <laughs> nice to meet you. Well, we almost didn't hear you. It's just like, yeah. it's crazy. So this is the bike. So is it already on? No way. Oh my God, it is already on. You can't even tell when it's on or off. That's insane. Whoa. <laughs> That's insane. Oh my lord. That is so fast. Woohoo!
We have reached the Gombori Pass. Nice. Oh, I don't know if I can get up there. No. <laughs> I don't know if I can get up here. This is pretty extreme for me. Yeah, you. <laughs> yeah, do it. I'm going to give it a go. <laughs> I did it. Okay, wait, wait. I do that bit first. <laughs> wait a second. Yes! Oh my lord! <laughs> so here we go, this is home, home for the next couple of days. Oh, it's nice. Look at this. There's lights. Oh my God, we are living in the future. It's gonna be nice. It's just so nice to be riding in the winding mountain roads with another awesome moto traveler. So yeah, it's really cool that we could do this together. Oh, and I think we're here. Look at that. Whoa, there it is. Ananuri Fortress. Magica. What a setting, hey? Wow. Just on top of the reservoir. Whoa, that looks amazing. Yes! Mark Travel Mark sticker on the windshield of fame! Thanks yeah, Mark! I'm so, honored. I'm so honored to be with all the other people there. Uh oh, I hope they will last Mark, they I don't know. Last. It's high quality. It's high quality? Yeah, link below. <laughs> it was actually super nice to spend a couple of days here in the city. We were walking around, we had like nice meals. It was a really nice vibe. The city has really nice historical places and the old town is just super beautiful. So it's definitely a city which you should visit at least once in your life. Entrance. Looks like it. <laughs> good afternoon. Good afternoon. Good afternoon, Mr. Cow. Good afternoon. Good Whoa, afternoon. There's a whole herd coming down the road. <laughs> get out the way, get out the way. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Oh, that's cool. Whose idea was this? Come on, own up. <laughs> oh, amazing. Hello. Nice. Beautiful. Wow. There it is. We have finally officially made it to the Black Sea. Wow. It's beautiful here. 
amazing to think that on the other side of this sea is Bulgaria and Bulgaria is like still so far away no <laughs> <laughs> there's already Europe made it to the Black Sea do, do, yeah. do, do, do. <laughs> this is a milestone this is the next sea yes. first it was the Caspian then the Black Sea and then it'll be the Mediterranean yes oh yes <laughs> getting closer and closer yeah but I can tell you my bump is hurting <laughs> Look, there's some other bikes here. Cool. Watch out for the dog poop. Oh no! Show me your foot. Yeah, you stepped in the dog poop. Anyway, doesn't mean that I have good luck. Does it mean good luck? Yes. Good. Good luck for a successful border crossing. So I think this is the border here. Look at this uh, border building. It's a really interesting construction. Whoa, look at this. Okay, so trucks, 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 cars, cars, cars. I think we'll just go here. Okay. You're from Turkey? Uh, Turkey. Turkey, cool. English? America? Uh, English. 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 Uh, and German? Germania? Uh, Alman. 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 So we've been waiting here for like half an hour and it's not really moving forward. And also we see that all of the passengers of the cars have gone over to like the walk-in entrance, which is super, super crowded, full of people and looks like it has a huge, huge queue. So we're really hoping that Lavi doesn't get sent over in the walk-in. Yeah, otherwise we're gonna be waiting ages. 12 seconds later. Yeah. Here, yes. Turkey, yes. <laughs> Turkey, yeah, yes. Three, two, one. Nice. Thank you so much. Thank cool. You. Thank you. Show me your nice trousers. <laughs> They're doing great. <laughs> At least I'm not wearing a bin bag. What? That's new fashion. And I got this bin bag from our friends in Russia. <laughs> Lavi's getting the Sergei rain treatment. <laughs> Anti-rain, hey? <laughs> Thanks, Olga and Sergei. Whoa, look at this. Look at these cliffs. Yeah, we made it into the mountains yeah and it's not raining right now which i'm really happy about so we reconnected the media mod but we have left the black sea coast and now yes we're heading inland into the mountains to see a beautiful mountain monastery wow look at that What a place! What a place! Wow. The way that it's all just carved out of the rock it looks so spectacular. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. English? Uh, yes. Oh, yes. <laughs> We have still some oil dripping here from our suspension and we watched a video recently that you can actually create your own little tool to clean it out. So this is what we did here. <laughs> yep. Okay, cool. Yep. 
Whoa, wow, look at this. Yeah, it looks crazy here. Wow, that's Whoa. a view. Yeah, look at the valley down there. Let's check it out, eh? Yeah. It's a perfect little lookout place. I love it yeah. when you get to a <laughs> viewpoint and then there's the perfect little little place to look out. That's great. Whoa. Picking up some supplies. Ekmek. <laughs> it's our first Turkish word we've learnt. Ekmek. Ekmek. Bread. Nice. Thank you. Thank you. Can't go wrong with that. It's dinner and breakfast. <laughs> some Ekmek. Well, coming into a super crazy gorge here. Look at this. It's awesome. Stunning views. Wow. Whoa, what a road. Look at this. Absolute favorite road here. Yeah, this is one of the most spectacular roads we've ridden in a long time. In a long time. Wow, that's pretty close there. Look at that. Yeah. Oh, oh, bash plate. Okay, I think they're referring to here. I guess anywhere here. Okay, not too bad. That is pretty good, hey? So we can actually still see the ferry coming in just there. Amazing view, look at that. I'm just cleaning off the oil. It looks like that it's still leaking and it doesn't look very good you can see here as well a lot of oil so i think it's about three or four rides to antalya and then we desperately have to change the seal because if the oil is dripping on the brake pads it's not a good idea oh just for us hey i don't know let's see if there is a let's space see. hello it's okay yeah? Okay. <laughs> oh. Apparently it's alright. Okay. But I've got to turn around. Okay. Uh, wait, I will yeah, maybe yeah. jump off. Okay. Okay. Just straight. Cool. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Wait a minute, wait for this guy. Yep, yep. now it's me. Wait, 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 wait. He wants to go as well. Wait, he wants to go as well, let him go, and now. <laughs> Woo! <Yes. laughs> Always a little bit of a challenge, but okay. Oh, here we go. Nemrut it's... Dagi. That's Mount Nemrut in oh. Turkish. Wow, this location here is just mind blowing. <laughs> Absolutely crazy it is absolutely crazy whoa that's kind of the cool thing about going to see some points of interest on this journey it's like why else would you ever come all the way up here exactly but i'm really glad we're here look at this yeah spectacular okay got some switchback starting now oh my goodness okay yeah 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 yeah, yeah. Oh, oh.
look at that. Wow. <laughs> Amazing. What a view from up here. This is absolutely crazy. So this is Mount Nemrut. And behind me is the ancient tomb of King Antiochus I of Commagene. These super impressive statues behind me were built in 62 BC, so more than 2,000 years ago. And it depicts the king himself sitting in the center, flanked by various Greek and Iranian gods, including Zeus and Hera. There's a turtle here in the road. A massive turtle! Wow, cool! I think we should help it cross the road, hey? Yeah. I think he's heading this way. Okay, buddy, we're gonna put you in the right place. Wow! Oh, he's quite big. It's quite heavy. Hello. Hello. Come, let's go. Wow, what an amazing creature. I reckon I'll put him, because he'll probably find it hard over these rocks. <coughs> Here, on the grass. Here. Yeah, perfect. There you go. Beautiful. Yes, found a kebab yes. shop. <laughs> oh yeah, we're hungry. <laughs> uh, maybe a durum. But which one? What is this one? This is chikofte. What is chikofte? Right Turkish special food. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> wow, you can see here, look at this, all of this. This is still from the earthquake eight months ago. Look how destroyed this whole place is. Wow, is there really supposed to be the hotel right here? That's so mad. Whoa, look at these guys. Oh, they're stopping. Nice. <laughs> wow. Hello. <laughs> Very nice. It's a British car. Yeah. Can I jump in? <laughs> yeah, come in. Wow. We, we looked up your trip going from India to London yes. in this British car. Yes. That's amazing. The idea was that you know, wherever it went, it, it brought joy to the people. Yeah. You know, it brought a smile on people's faces. And that's why we wanted to do this, you know, just to give joy and smiles to people across the world. We've also got ourselves a nice picnic. This is all just stuff that we've taken from the free breakfasts over the last two days at the hotels. <laughs> so what have we got? With some eggs, some cheese. For me, some salad. And then we have these like deep fried cheesy rolls i think Whoa. Mm. oh no there's actually ham inside so we're coming into the cappadocia area now and we're already starting to see some beautiful rock formations yeah it really looks so cool wow look, look at this this is the fairy castle oh These. and they have like loads of them around this area beautiful look at that Hello. Whoa, what a crazy area. Absolutely magical place, hey? So at the moment, they're just pumping air actually in the balloon and they're getting bigger and bigger. So cool. There's so many of them. It's so big. Whoa, here we go. Whoa. It's going up right, it's going up right. It's going, it's going. It's going. Yes. Wow.
Bye-bye. <laughs> <Bye -bye. laughs> oh my god! <laughs> Whoa, they're really all starting to launch up in the air now. Everywhere, all around us. This place is so incredible. There are so many and you can see people doing photo shoots over there. Like a girl with a really nice dress. Oh, amazing! What a place! What a place, what a place. Hey guys! <laughs> this is the reason why I love traveling. I love it so much. It's not everywhere in the world you can see this. The Turkish people, they just created something really, really, really incredible here. It's like the best idea ever. I would love to work here, you know. I want to work here. I want to see this every day. It's like a dreamland. Moto ADV garage. It's like a little ADV course here. <laughs> Just to get to the ADV garage. <laughs> oh, there's a bike from Austria. Hello. Hello, <laughs> Hello how's it going? One shift later. Oh yes, there she is. So here is the harbour of Antalya and this is the old town here and you can see all of the old walls of the city. So we are here and today we're going to be making our way through the countryside of Turkey taking some smaller roads to reach one of its most beautiful sites, Pamukkale. So this place, Pamukkale, which means cotton castles, is a natural thermal hot springs and it just looks like an absolutely spectacular place and I think you can swim in the hot springs, so I can't wait to see it. check out up here apparently there's supposed to be some camping spots up on the hill ah oh, this this spit man ah oh, it's quite a rough road I think that's why people put wild camp up here because no one else is coming here so I think I'm gonna take this line here a bit of a rock step there but it looks like I can just stay in this little groove and just basically just power my way all the way to the top should be all right <laughs> okay. No matter what, don't stop, don't stop. Let's go. <laughs> nice. All right, let's set up camp. currently 5.50 and uh, a whole bunch of guys with trucks just arrived here in this field because actually they launch hot air balloons from this field. They've all just arrived and they've started setting up their hot air balloons. It's time for us to set up Bumblebee and head over to Pamukkale. I can see the balloons already! We were camping basically here exactly where these guys are launching from. The balloons are just passing right over the thermal pools. Oh wow, look at that! Ma 
massive here. Absolutely massive. Do you think they had like like fights down there as well? They would have had probably tigers and lions coming out of there. <laughs> uh, exactly. They might have been gladiators here. That's super impressive. Wow, I didn't expect that. So now it is quarter past 12. We have packed a lot into our morning, but it's time to hit the road. Bye bye, beautiful place. And our next destination is Turkey's largest city, Istanbul. You! And the bridge that will cross the Bosphorus Strait into Europe. <laughs> yes. It's going to be a massive milestone on our journey. So it is way too far to get to Istanbul today. The uh, Garmin estimates that it will take us nearly seven hours to ride there. So we are just going to ride as far as we can today and then we'll hopefully get there at some point tomorrow. Just a, this grass area down here. Okay. Yeah, I mean, this looks really nice. It does. I mean, there's lots and lots of poop on the floor, <laughs> though. <laughs> but I if don't we mind. can find a spot without poop, then I think it's lovely. There's a grass spot here. This is like <laughs> right next to the lake. <laughs> nice. What a spot. Wow, beautiful. It was so cold and so uncomfortable. This is my blow up pillow. Broken. <laughs> I feel like that I couldn't sleep at all because it was so freezing cold. I had to put on my motorcycle trousers, my leggings and my waterproof trousers as well. It was so cold. And it's still cold. <laughs> Let's see if some coffee will help. This was coffee. Delicious. Oh my god. What the hell? <laughs> Misty all around. Misty? You can't see anything. It looks cold everywhere. No. It actually looks cold. Seriously, I didn't expect that. Let's go back in the tent. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa, here it is, guys. The Bosphorus Bridge. Can you believe it? After 40,000 miles, we will finally head back into Europe. This is going to be absolutely <laughs> crazy. <laughs> Why would you believe it? There's a traffic jam. <laughs> <laughs> on the bridge! That's great! Yeah, I think it's really fitting that our return to Europe is in a traffic jam! <laughs> yes! Anyway, this will give us a lot of time to appreciate this beautiful, amazing bridge connecting Asia to Europe. <sighs> this is definitely a very, very nice moment. This is it. This is us saying goodbye to Asia. Bye-bye, Asia! And hello to Europe! <laughs> Oh yes, this is it! <laughs> Touching down in Europe! <laughs> Yay! 
<laughs> we made it! Happy and alive! <laughs> <laughs> How cool is that, hey? We have just crossed from the Asian side of Istanbul to the European side and 40,000 miles after leaving Europe, we're back, baby. We are back. Oh, cool, look at the sign. Welcome, Welcome to, to Europe. Europe! Yes! <laughs> Welcome to Europe! <laughs> oh, that's amazing. That oh, is cool. amazing. This is a milestone. This is a major milestone of the journey after so many miles since Vladivostok. I mean, I don't even know how many miles we've ridden since we landed in Vladivostok, but it feels like a lifetime ago. <laughs> yes. Whoa, here we go, guys. There it is up ahead. No way. That is absolutely massive. Wow. Wow, there you go. We've made it. I'm standing right in front of the Hagia Sophia, the landmark of Istanbul. I can't believe that we rode Bumblebee all the way here. Wow.